Something magic happens Every time you go You make the magic happen The magic of Orioles baseball Hey guys, how's everybody doing today? Autographs 2000 here. And in this video, I have got five autographs through the mail, TTMs. And I'm also going to show you a contest win that I got. As always, we'll start with some TTMs. The first one is from West Palm Beach, Florida. And we have got Luis Pujols. He signed three of three in 20 days. He had a career batting average of 193 with six home runs, 81 RBIs. He played nine years, appeared in 316 games. He played from 77 to 85, and he played with Houston, Kansas City, and Texas. Um, he was also the manager of Detroit in 2002. And in that year, he had a managerial record of 55 and 100. That is not a good winning percentage, ladies and gentlemen. That is Luis Pujols. All right, our second return is from Carroll Stream, Illinois. We have got Buzz Capra. He signed three of three in six days. He had a career record of 31 and 37 with a 3.87 ERA. He played seven years. He played he appeared in 142 games. He, <clears throat> he played from 71 to 77. And he played with the Mets and the Braves. He was an all-star in 1974. And in that year, he went 16-8 and eight with a 2.28 ERA, which won him the ERA title that year. Um, he also finished ninth in the Cy Young voting and 20th in the MVP voting. <coughs> Excuse me. And I did send him this. I asked him, is your time truly wasted if you enjoy wasting it? And he said, sometimes and no. So I guess he thought that was two questions. Is your time truly wasted? And he said, sometimes. And if he enjoys wasting it, he said, no. I, I, enjoy, I enjoy a good waste of time every now and then. All right. Our next return is from St. Petersburg, Florida. We have got Ted Power. He signed three of four in 40 days. He had a career record of 68 and 69 with a 4.00 ERA. He played 13 years. He appeared in 564 games. He played from 81 to 93. And he played with LA, Cincinnati, Kansas City, Detroit, St. Louis, Pittsburgh, Cleveland, and Seattle. His best year was in 1985 when he went 8 and 6 with a 2.70 ERA and he had a career best 27 saves. And he did not sign the other Fleer. And that is Ted Power. All right, our fourth return 
is from, is from White River Junction, Ver or Vermont. We have got Jim Beatty. He signed three of three in 14 days. He had a career record of 52 and 87 <clears throat> with a 4.17 ERA. He played nine years. He appeared in 203 games. He played from 78 to 86. And he played with the Yankees and Mariners. He won a World Series in 1978 with the Yankees. And his best year was in 1984 when he went 12 and 16 with a 3.41 ERA. But he also had 12 complete games that year. That was Jim BD. He was a workhorse in 84. All right, before we get to our last return, I'm going to show you a contest win I got. And it is from Mr. Alan Twitchell. <clears throat> I will leave a description. I will leave a link to his channel in my description. If you can, please go over there and check him out. He is also into the TTM game. And he had a contest. And here is what I won. And his contest was he wanted everyone to guess how many cards, signed cards he had in his collection. And the answer was 1985 because he is a big Kansas City Royals fan. And this is the card that I won. Ching Man Wong as a pretty sweet Pretty sweet sign card right there. I was happy to win that. And he also threw, threw in this. We got a Peyton Manning and Jamal Lewis. And that is a game-worn jersey from Jamal Lewis. That is pretty sweet. Thank you, Alan, for that. And again, guys, if you can, go over there and check out his channel. And you won't be disappointed. Alan's a pretty pretty good guy. All right, our last return is from Dallas, Texas. And we have got Fred Stanley. He signed 404 in 16 days. He had a career batting average of 216 with 10 home runs, 120 RBIs. He played 14 years. He appeared in 816 games. He played from 69 to 82. Uh, he played with, he was the last player, the last current player to play with the Seattle Pilots. He also played with Milwaukee, Cleveland, San Diego, the Yankees, and Oakland. He won the World Series with the Yankees in 77 and 78. And then once his playing days were over, he became the Director of Player Development for San Francisco. And there, he won a World Series in 2010, 2012, and 2014. That is Fred Stanley. And I'm looking, we got all kinds of Yankees. We got Ching Meng Wong, Fred Stanley, and Jim Beatty. Didn't plan it that way, but that's how it happens sometimes. And guys, that is going to do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that like button. If you've not subscribed yet, please do so. And until next time, guys, Autographs 2000 is out.